God says your qualification is found in Calvary's shed blood, not in what you know or have accomplished. Your credibility is found in my favour, not in man's acceptance. Doors will open, keys will be dispersed, and breakthrough will occur as you seek. My thoughts and my purpose and open. Yourself to the anointing I am giving you today. Do not reject my procedure. You asked for an outcome, and I replied, that process leads to an outcome. This is what I mean by if you are willing and obedient, you will eat the good of the land, even in the presence of your adversaries. I have a table set for you. Come to my table by giving to my anointed process of emptying you or yourself and filling you with my I am -ness. So go about your day knowing that I am with you. I will never abandon or abandon you. Listen to the voice of my voice, even the Christ in you. I did not suffer and die to keep you in man's grasp, because who I am cannot be contained, and neither can you. Huge ones, but don't worry, I'll make even your blunders prosper. Abiding in the vine will replace accuracy and routine in your thoughts. God says my throne is in your hands. My dominion resides within you. My excuse and enormous power is in you, as a generative force to lift you and shape you into my image. Don't pay attention to the yapping of lost dogs. Let me vine and branch myself through you. You will bear fruit as I vine and branch myself in you. You will bear fruit and I will teach, train and instruct you so that you're Fruit will benefit you and many others who are crying out to me in this hour. There is nothing to prove when it comes to love, cannot be controlled or guilt into abandoning it. I will reveal to you the next major activity of my spirit, used to send the Pentecostal movement. I made this move and brought first, century Christianity back to the world. My church was forever changed after I launched the charismatic outpouring. I delivered the Word of Faith movement to my people and refresh their faith. I established the prophetic movement so that my people could hear my voice. My spirit's imminent outpouring will be an outpouring of my heart and love for the lost and all those who call on my name. Love loves on its terms, because I am love so love is always in command. Being in charge does not entail being stupid or shouting at the opposition. The days of yelling at the enemy are over. Simply enter equipped with my love. Does not take command, rather love is in command, because love is who I am and I. Am Lord even when I am love because. Being love to the world does not exclude being the Lord. So go out there and be loved by everyone around you. This day let love be more than what you do, but who you are. At first the world will scorn me as I pour out my love. They will scarf, but they will learn that I am and that you are my disciples. Through your love for one another, they will notice how deep and abide in your love for one another is. People will observe this love and wonder, they'll wonder where they can go and how. They can acquire that sort of love in their lives. Bring them to me. The gathering will manifest itself in the unleashing of my love on a scale unseen in modern times. Sweetheart love is who I am, let love be who you are now. Type guess if you believe. God bless you.